First, we are working the latest in a deadly fishing accident in Middletown. The Pit Point News Tracker taking you to the waters off Satuas Point. That's where authorities say a wave swept the victim into the water. I would assume reporter Nicole Estefan has the details that are new at 530. We're told 48-year-old Gary Mathias was in the water for an hour and a half before crews pulled him out. Eyewitness News spoke with firefighters about the rescue efforts and how all this happened. The crash is pretty hard on the rocks. It's, it's very uneven. It can be very dangerous. As the water crashes against the shore at the Satuist Point Wildlife Refuge in Middletown, the peaceful sound is deceiving considering its power and potential danger. One of them ended up in the water. Uh, it was pretty high surf. It was very treacherous, very dangerous out there. Middletown's fire chief, Ron Dory, tells us at four Wednesday morning, a frazzled fisherman ran into this Cumberland Farms on Aquidneck Avenue. He told the clerk to call 911 because his friend needed help. Police tell us the two were fishing off the rocks at the point when 48-year-old Gary Mathias of Portsmouth was swept in. He just couldn't, couldn't make his way back onto shore. Police launched the search from a third beach in Middletown. It wasn't long before they had Mathias in their sights. Uh, there was a light uh, attached to him, and so when uh, the waves crashed over him, uh, you, could, you could sometimes see the light, sometimes you couldn't. We've learned it is not uncommon for fishermen to take advantage of the dark hours here at the refuge. They allow uh, people to fish out there, uh, but uh, obviously it's, very, it's much more dangerous at night. Matthias was rushed to the hospital where he was pronounced dead. Police tell us that the incident remains under investigation tonight. In the newsroom, Nicole Estefan, Eyewitness News.